That was good, honey. Mama lost the remote. Cut! Ha! <sighs> After 2,000 years. Ready? Lights, camera, action. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Vlogmas 2021, which I'm so sorry I bailed on. I'm so sorry I couldn't go through with the 25 days, 25 videos promise that I actually made in the initial video of Vlogmas. I did want to do that. That was the initial plan. But to be very honest with you, with everything that's been happening in my life, I just could not make the time for it. And even though on this channel we hustle together and we work really hard to make sure we achieve our goals, that does not mean that we can burn out in the process, right? I need to know where I have to balance and prioritize. And just putting out 25 videos for the heck of it was not making sense. So what I realized was that Vlogmas is about Christmas. It's about being joyful, happy, balancing your life and closing out the end of the year on a happy note. So I'm going to bring you as many videos as I can, which is going to roll with it. I'm going to, of course, Stick to my Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday schedule. But if I can give you bonus uploads, I will definitely try for it. But all of them will be good quality, happy, fun content, which I am happy to put out there and y'all will be happy to consume. With that today, I am bringing to you Christmas gifting ideas under a budget. Because Lord knows I need to go under a budget right now. I've made a very, 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 very hefty investment. You all know it and I'm yet to see the results of it. It's going to take me years to be able to reap the results the way I want to for that investment and even though last year I went all out to gift my friends and family and I spent so much in the gifting process of Christmas so of course this year also I want my friends and family to feel special but I also want to feel happy while doing that for them and I cannot afford to go beyond a certain budget so I thought a lot of you all will be sailing in the same boat as me so I'm bringing you five gender neutral very meaningful gifting items these are not DIYs or anything actually you can buy it but rupees 50 se le Okay, rupees 2000 tak, I'm gonna extend it and give you a lot of options so if you're interested then continue watching but if this is the first time you've come on my channel then hi I'm Sara I make beauty and lifestyle content here on YouTube take a moment hit that subscribe button join the Sara squad I'm sure you love it here and also don't forget to hit the bell icon right next to it so that every time I upload a video you get notified and with that we can dive straight into this today's video will also be holding the second giveaway of my vlogmas so I'm going to announce all of the rules at the end of the video so stay tuned till the end to know what they are gifting option number one that is something i personally love 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 receiving as a gift and that is plants i discovered my love for plants and the fact that i could actually care for plants and you know let them grow and just the whole idea of gardening became so strong in me as a person after my friend gifted me my first coleus which was a small baby plant he gifted me i will insert a photo here and it was very like when he gifted it to me I was like most probably I'm gonna kill this but thank you so much like I was happy but I was like oh my god what have you gifted me but he was like try not to kill it and I watered it like on and off on and off polis is such a low maintenance plant and it has bloomed so much it's lived a full life in my home and like about eight months or nine months is its entire life cycle and beautiful beautiful plant if you see the image of it right now like that is how it looks right now I'm not disturbing my coleus right now because it's big and it's also night time as I'm filming this but that's a great very affordable and low maintenance gifting option for any friend like me who feels like they cannot garden or does not like gardening or does not love plants that much you might discover your love for plants with something so low maintenance as a coleus because that was my first plant I actually care for so I'm sharing that with you coleus is also like a mid-range plant anything between 150 to 200 is what you get coleus in like nurseries in Mumbai for another very 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 affordable 50 rupees plan which is amazing to give this my Sada Bahar I recently got like three Sada Bahars and they are also super low maintenance like not really low maintenance if they don't have any water they don't have any water they don't have any water but like they don't have any water you know and they grow towards sunlight so my Sada Bahar stays like this and it grows outwards towards the sun it's so pretty all of the flowers every three days they die and then they bloom again they die they bloom again and they are beautiful beautiful this plant pot I got from Ikea which was also around 200 something but the plant in itself is just 
50 rupees and I think that's a great great plan to gift again. Another very good plan that you must ideally gift somebody is a bonsai. A bonsai should be given like as a housewarming gift or somebody who's starting a new journey. It's supposed to be like the lucky plant for you. My bonsai has also shooted and outshooted quite a lot ever since I got this. My mom gifted it to me as a housewarming present in the SSS. Bonsai is a very very good plant. Bonsai's range anywhere from 700 all the way to like 1500 also. Jitna bada bonsai khari doge, utna mehenga ho sakta hai. So this is like a nice luxury uh, plant that you can gift someone. It's still small. It's very very low maintenance. Bonsai also does not need maintenance at all. Barely like pani dalne bhool bhi gai to ho marta nahi hai itna easily. I think plants are very meaningful also because they are like a living thing. So you're gifting life to someone for it to like you know bloom and get better and I definitely feel plants make for better gifts than flowers. I really don't enjoy getting flowers as gifts because they die in two days and it makes me very sad when they die and it just is the whole experience is very short lived whereas with a plant you can keep on growing it and growing it and every time like I water my plants I think of the people who gifted it to me you know. So I think it always reminds you of that person. It's a very very meaningful gift to give but of course you can only gift a plant to somebody you're meeting in person on Christmas. You can't courier post a plant or do a prime day delivery if you will for the people you are distance gifting my second gifting option would be really really useful for you and that is perfumes perfumes are evergreen okay unisex gender neutral everybody enjoys a good fragrance on their body you know how much I love body odor like that, that's the first thing I notice in a person when a person walks into a room and they smell fresh and good I instantly you know like just it awakens my senses and I'm like mm, you smell good like you know and I will always ask what perfume are you wearing if, if you're smelling good. My recommendations for perfumes for gifting this season have to be the Free of Prejudice perfumes by Miniso. Now this is a unisex perfume range which is so great and so refreshing. I kid you not these last so long on my skin. Like I wore this day before yesterday and it was there on that outfit till today. Like I re-wore that outfit today and that outfit still had that perfume fragrance and that's very 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 good for a perfume but these cost only Rs. 350 and the longevity, the quality of perfume that you're getting for 350 rupees I think is banging good and they come in like six variants I have like four of them right now with me the one I'm first holding is blues now blues is a date night fragrance okay it's that sexy very very woody aromatic you're walking through a deep forest kind of fragrance I know like I love men who wear fragrances like this but I also love wearing fragrances like this definitely a date night sexy kind of vibe a more fresh a more daytime kind of vibe is snow white this is a very unique fragrance altogether like it has that strong jasmine rose mix but the citrus undernote to it is so nice and refreshing so it is refreshing at the same time floral so it again makes for a very good unisex perfume it's not very feminine but it's not very masculine at the same time it's very gender neutral and I think a lot of people would love Snow White it's more broad spectrum like that in favoritism I prefer using this like on the go when I'm not in a certain sort of a mood then Snow White is that you know it creates a mood altogether if you like something more feminine more floral then Ariel has to be the perfume for you it's literally a flower in a bottle like I cannot describe it any better anybody who would love floral notes in their perfume or would love to smell like a flower all day would love Ariel the perfume I'm also currently wearing is Jazz oh my god Jazz is mm, it is a I cannot describe this perfume like this is sexy in a bottle it just smells so 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 nice it's definitely a people pleaser kind of perfume the major notes in this are vanilla and patchouli and again it's something that everybody will love and I wear jazz the most it's definitely again date night evening dinner sort of a vibe but you can wear jazz whenever you want and you'll be put into a mood altogether once you spray these or you have to like wait for them to like disperse on your skin and then the aroma that fills like right now my room smells heavily with these perfumes great thing about them is they're travel friendly they're small so you can just throw it in your purse keep it in your dashboard in your car and you can travel with these very easily so if you want to like touch up on the go you can always like refresh before your date comes into the car
For the Christmas season, the Miniso perfume bottles also have this surprise voucher hidden in them. So it's a gift on top of a gift. You might just open your perfume bottle and stumble upon a voucher for shopping at Miniso. Additionally, Miniso also has a membership plan running and that has some great perks to it. I will make sure to leave the brief completely in the description box and also a link for y'all in the description box so that you can register because on registering for the Miniso membership, you will straight up be getting a rupees 80 voucher. You know Miniso has a great inventory of stuff right from affordable all the way to expensive. Whatever you want to get for yourself or your friends or family or whatever, you can have a wide inventory of products. So I think signing up for the membership would be a great offer for you. I would also like to thank Miniso for partnering with me for today's video. The third gifting option has to be a box full of coffee, Sara, Pyar. I mean, who wouldn't love receiving this beautiful box from Impulse Coffees, which has very, very good three coffee flavors in them. And also additionally, they come with stickers. I mean, you can put this on your laptop, on your phone case, and your phone case, laptop, everything will be Christmas ready. This is like a plus plus. Additionally, you know, the owner writes a personalized note for everyone who buys this box. And I think that's super cool. And and of course the flavors are the charm of the impulse coffees box we have the charo vanilla mocha pe choka and rat ki rani espresso these flavors are exceptionally good like i mean how can i brag about them myself but they are really really premium arabica coffee so so well infused and balanced with flavor i would love to thank you all for all the love you all have shown impulse coffees in general i am so grateful that it just met all the expectations that i had with my company flavor profile wise everyone everyone literally so far so good alhamdulillah i have not received a single person drink impulse coffees and say it's abg it's average or it's not good enough uh, i have tried to make it the most value for your money this entire gift set retails for rupees 1197 which is full value for all of the three coffees individually which is 399 for each coffee inclusive of taxes also so it's actually 338 uske upar gst chadta hai but piche piche maine tumko kabhi bataya nahi ki we have our impulse coffees crossword also over here if you fill out this crossword and get all the answers right then you get a chance to actually uh, taste our next samples before they launch so i think it's a very wholesome gift to give and also it's a collector's item because once it's gone it's gone baby it is very 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 limited edition and as we speak today there are very very few of these gift sets remaining so grab them before they are gone because once gone, Gone, gone baby, they will never come back. Fourth gifting option has to be journals and planners and notebooks. Again, super gender neutral and I think December is a great time to gift somebody planners and notebooks because it's like wrapping up your year, you know, you want to start fresh. Just, you know, burn the old notebooks if you want to or just keep them in a drawer and start fresh completely. So it's like giving somebody a fresh start. That's how I look at it. And gifting a planner maybe or even notebooks for them to just like pen down their thoughts is a great, great gifting idea. Of course, Simba Lifestyle and HK, Haley and Kumar both have some great planners that I'm going to be putting to use this year. So that's what I recommend. Haley and Kumar's planner is something more gender neutral since we are talking about more gender neutral gifts. Uh, then I think this is great for your guy friends or for your partners, for your male partners specifically or somebody who doesn't like too much jazz happening. This is very, very simple, sleek and what I like is that it's travel friendly. It's A4 size only. So this is a notebook I would keep in my car. You know, a lot of the times I get keep getting calls now is in my car and I have to pen down stuff while I'm driving I cannot really go back on my phone and type stuff out so I like park and I start noting down things and I have a very very good habit actually of noting everything down so I like putting things on pen and paper of course I've not started using it because it's for the next year but I love the colors that's happening in the H&K planner this year it's just classy chic I love the whole vibe of the H&K planner and there are a lot of blank pages inside super affordable as well this is somewhere around 600 less than that only I'm giving you a round figure if you want something more feminine then the Simba lifestyle planner is definitely the option to go if you want to gift your female partner somebody who likes more feminine things floral things because this is based on live life in full bloom it's based on the 20 24 or 12 12 flowers of the this you also get like stickers in this planner you get stickers in H&K planner also you get a free notebook with this and it's very 
feminine like this really beautiful artwork happening in the Simba lifestyle planner the pages on the Simba lifestyle planner are different like they are glossy and then they are matte and it's a bigger planner definitely more heavy and more chunky this is the kind of planner I'm gonna keep on my desk like I'm gonna keep it here because while my meetings happen I can take notes and take appointments in this planner again great gifting option this costs I think a thousand rupees with all of the added perks to it if you don't want to gift something expensive like planners a little more expensive then great affordable options are notebooks i have these beautiful notebooks from hnk again this is the chai addict and this is on a pizza diet i think they're so cool and so cute because a chai addict although i'm a coffee lover myself but i think i will give this to my mother she would love just noting things down in this and writing as it comes to her head my mom has also now become a coffee person we are all impulse coffees ambassadors but on a pizza diet is something it's true to me and how last gifting option for you guys but definitely not the least has to be another fragrant gifting option and that is the Bath & Body Works candles not just Bath & Body Works but candles in general make for great gender neutral again gifting option you can gift them to anyone somebody who's having a housewarming somebody who's hosting a party you can always it's such a nice for the Bath & Body Works candles come in very good glass um, cases you know and they make for a great gift just by itself like I love just holding on B&B candles because I like to gift them to people and every time I pick a candle as per that person's personality or mood and I think it's very unique because they have a lot of fragrances for you to choose from I'm just gonna list a few that I love now that they have their Christmas fragrances I love blackberries and basil I'm still thinking and contemplating if I want to gift blackberries and basil to someone or if I want to burn it for Christmas this year so I'm not burning it so far but something I'm definitely burning for Christmas this year is flannel it's a very very nice fragrance. I think it's new because I've never, never smelled flannel before. And it's so comforting. Oh my god, I'm gonna smell, like I'm gonna be burning this for my rosary the entire year now. You know how much I love my white mahogany tea coat. It's a classic, it's sexy, it's again unisex actually and very evening date night vibe. You can never go wrong with white mahogany tea coat. And a fragrance that my car actually smells like is Cactus Blossom because yeah, my car smells exactly like this because I have the Cactus Blossom car freshener uh, in my car. So I have a lot of Cactus Blossom. I have their spray, I have the candle and I have the car freshener. That's how much I love Cactus Blossom as a fragrance. So a lot of recommendations here for you. But uh, you can also check out my shorts video that I did over here. I have recommended my all time favorite, all season favorite Bath & Body Works candle. So you can choose from there. You can decide your fragrance as per the person's personality and that goes both for perfume candles and a lot of things can be customized over here while still being budget friendly now BNB candles are expensive or uh, if you want more inexpensive options I currently don't have them over here in this room but Suhani Candles is a homegrown small company. They actually make soy candles, which is really good. It does not generate a lot of soot. And I love the shapes they do. If you've seen in my haul, I keep those cubic uh, kind of uh, candles. I don't burn them much. I just keep them as decor. And they look so good. They're completely soy candles. Then I have this body-shaped candle. I'm going to insert photos for you, which is from Zuri Curators. They actually made this entire box for me and added it to that. So again, great, great gifting option. I think it's amazing to gift somebody a nice body shaped candle or a wool shaped candle it's so unique to be gifting somebody that and it's again inexpensive not that expensive to get yourself those unique shaped candles so that completes it that's all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it was something different i loved to list down all my gifting ideas that i'm going to be utilizing for christmas this year because we want to go budget friendly low key but also make sure that our friends and family feel special and feel loved every single day of the year not just christmas i hope you guys enjoyed the giveaway of today's video the winner will be winning all of these lovely items if you want to participate in the giveaway then you have to be subscribed to my channel to impulse coffees youtube channel and also follow me on instagram impulse coffees on instagram if you don't have an instagram that's completely okay all of the people who are participating definitely have to leave a comment down below and let me know what did you receive for a christmas gift last year or if you don't celebrate christmas then for new year or diwali which was your most cherished gift from 2021 let me know in the comments below along with your comment also mention your instagram handle if instagram nahi hai to fir apna email address mention kar do it will do for me so that i can let you know when you win the giveaway i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye guys love you
Thank you.